Okay. This here is my new boat. Been stored for 11 years. Yeah, we're gonna make a fishing boat out of her before the end of summer. And today I'm gonna be getting inside of it. It's full of fishing lures and equipment. All that good stuff. But as you can see, it needs a good power washing. It's a 285 slick craft. I've been in it once, but okay, and you can see where I got into her once this year. I brought some mothballs with me and a tape measure. And a box we're going to empty some stuff out of it, but I'm up to take a measurements to make some rod holders that I want And just get it started. I'll probably take the shrink wrap off in a week or two All right next video will be once I'm in it Okay All oh, these batteries are junk Okay, so Cutting inside a little bit. This is some of the garbage that's in here. Now, some of the stuff I pulled out of the new boat. There's still a lot more fishing gear still in there. Nice little package of J plugs. Certain of the flies. J plugs and then in this goodie box we got J plugs flashers dipsy divers dodgers and about 45 or 50 spoons are in the bottom of that <clears throat> and then I've got a about four more boxes of spoons still on the boat. Another box. Got a bunch of spoons, some flies, fishing line, all kinds of assorted stuff in there. These are just all flashers. All different kinds of them. Another bag of them there. I'll give you an idea. Solid box there. Pretty deep box there. And this is just a portion of what's on the boat. 
Yeah, not to mention the downriggers, outriggers. There's a box this size that's filled solid with line releases for the planer boards. And then I've got another box that's, oh, probably about the size of the fly box here. It's full of line releases for the downriggers. So I got a lot of work to do putting new hooks on most of these and uh, cleaning them up. They've been sitting for 11 years.